And we are excited to be joined in the booth here today by a couple of special guests. First off is Mike Corrigan of the Metropolitan Utilities District, natural gas vehicle specialist, Mike, and it's a pleasure to have you with us. How are you today? Very good. I'm glad to be here. Thank well, you. It's great to have you. We have Trey Mitty from Omaha Truck Center with us as well. And Trey, always good to see you as well. Great partner for us with the Husker Sports Network. Mike, let's start with you. What's new with natural gas vehicles in Omaha? Uh, well, we've had some really exciting progress here in the last year. Uh, with our own fleet of uh, compressed natural gas vehicles, we've grown to over 150 vehicles now. Happy Cab in Omaha is now running almost 60 vehicles on natural gas. So we've had a lot of fleet activity, and it's really exciting when you see a fleet like Backland Plumbing that's running 15 of their vehicles on natural gas, saving over $3,000 annually on fuel costs each on each vehicle. It really shows you what, what can happen with CNG. You see the light kind of go on with more and more companies as we move forward. You mentioned Happy Cab. You mentioned uh, you know, the Backland Plumbing. Who are some other people that are using CNG right now? Yeah, we've got several par public and private fleets now running on natural gas, including the city of Omaha, uh, Douglas County, uh, Metro Community College. Werner Enterprises is running a couple of semi-trucks now for about the last eight months and having really good results with it. Uh, so there's there's several several others now that are getting doing pilot projects using our public stations. Uh, the, city, the UNO, Creighton University now are getting involved. Uh, several other private fleets, so it's it's really starting to take off. You know, the public side, a lot of people who are listening probably wondered, you know, where are some of the public fueling stations in Omaha specifically? Sure, and we've got uh, two public stations in Omaha right now, and we're planning to get started building a third one this year in a West Omaha location. The two right now are at 53rd and L Street and also at 64th Avenue and Center. And uh, as we get more of these fleets get involved and interested, we're really excited now to have some local availability for vehicles. And just recently, Omaha Truck Center has gotten involved. They're going to be doing vehicle conversions as well as uh, pr providing sales and service with their new Freightliner trucks. So Trey Mitty is here to kind of introduce some of that. We're really excited to have that engagement from a, a, a great local company like Omaha Truck Center. Yeah, Mike just mentioned it, Trey, you know, how you guys have come together and getting you involved from a CNG standpoint. How did it come about and, and, and specifically kind of break down how you're involved? Yeah, thank you, Mike. Um, our truck center companies is, is uh, are are the largest uh, dealership in the Midwest, offering Freightliner trucks primarily. Uh, but we also offer parts and service for all makes and models of trucks. And due to the excitement of of CNG in the out in the field, we started a new division called Truck Center Companies Fuel Solutions, and we are specializing. Um, in alternative fuels, but prim also CNG, and we're here to answer any questions that may be out there. Uh, as Mike said, we do offer uh, dedicated CNG in the Freightliner products, but we also offer uh, conversion kits for uh, other light and medium-duty vehicles. So you can provide not only you know new Freightliner CNG trucks, but you, you can also provide conversions for the existing vehicles. We do. We install and we service uh, conversion kits for many full-size pickups, vans, and SUVs, and it gives an opportunity for existing uh, vehicle owners to take advantage of the of the benefits of CNG. What are some of those benefits, Trey? One of the largest ones would be uh, the fuel price. Uh, today in, in this area, it's between $1.80 and $1.90, and over the last year, the average has been about $1.72 less than, than a gallon of, of gasoline, and it'd be even larger savings with from a gallon of, of diesel. Uh, as well as uh, the maintenance is less on them because it burns cleaner. Uh, with that, for our environmentally conscious customers, there's about 90% less emissions than gasoline or diesel. And one of the great things is it's uh, it's a product that's found uh, right here in, in the U.S. Let's go back to fuel solutions. How can people get in contact on, on that side of things if they have more questions? Uh, they can contact Shane in, in Omaha at 402-592-0440 or reach us at info at tccfuelsolutions.com, or we're located on the, cor the northwest corner of 108th and L. Trey, it's always good to see you. Thanks Thank for stopping you. by it. tonight. Mike, appreciate it very much. Thank you, and thanks for all you're doing with CNG as well. Thank you. Go Huskers. Absolutely. A couple of great partners of the Husker Sports Network there, uh, Truck Center and, of course, uh, Metropolitan Utilities District joining us here in the booth. We'll take a break, and when we come back, the voice of the Huskers, Greg Sharp, has the opening pitch for you next. Stick around.